so early for the housemates to start having deep conversation or spilling so much about their lives at the point where they're trying to get to know each other, okay? So, um, like the twins, the Wani and the Handy, talking about their relationships and how they impersonate each other, okay, to cover up for their relationship. And Ruti, that is one of the pair of the flourish talking about her daughter okay talking about her 15 years old daughter and people were asking her at what age he gave it to her daughter so guys before we continue welcome back to the channel if you're new to this channel thank you so very much for stopping by please do well to like our videos subscribe to the channel as substance tv and turn on your post notifications so when we post a video you would be informed all right so there have been a lot of people digging into their private affairs okay so guys notwithstanding the house have been quite really interesting and i basically love how those housemates are trying as much as possible to get to know each other so well okay so guys um about these twins wani and handy like it's been so so difficult to um get to know who is who all right without their names tag like these people look very much alike they dress the same way okay they literally do everything alike so you basically find it very difficult to figure out who is who because they like the dress alike and they look so much alike all right they look really really so much alike and i think what i literally used to figure these people out is um um their body size but the thing is if these people are like if they're not together you find it difficult to figure them out like up till now i've not even known who is wani and who is handy okay but i've noticed that between these two sisters one particular person is livelier one particular person is out there she's outspoken like she's literally more of the energy person than the other sister okay and that is wani wani is very loud she's very very social like you just get to notice this particular girl okay you will get to notice her and each time i just see these people together i'll be like who is this particular girl so when i check i will notice when i check their batch i will notice that oh this person is one okay so and i noticed that um handy is literally laid back okay she's always there also but you know that she's not as she's not as hyperactive than um wani all right so that is that with these two so guys early today these um sisters were having a conversation okay about the people in the house that they vibe with a lot the people in the house that they relate to it very well okay so during the conversations um she mentioned that uh, she had a good chat with sean and she literally finds him very attractive okay she fancies him a lot so guys early this morning wani and sean were having a conversation at the garden all right and she told him that she's literally attracted to him so he asked her that if he wasn't in the house who would she have gone for okay because he literally saw one of the twins having a conversation with one of the Mbadiwe twins okay so he asked her the question and she was like She's actually not interested in anyone, okay, that they knew each other from outside, they follow themselves on Instagram, and the fact that they hang out or they basically meet or bump into each other at an event doesn't necessarily mean that, you know, she's interested in any of them, that she is attracted to him, Sean himself, okay, and no one else. So guys, in the course of their conversation, because I actually knew that these people were literally flowing so well, alright, you'll find out that these people actually have this good bond and vibes why they were talking right so during the course of their conversation you know they started talking about genotype and it was one that actually brought up the topic of genotype then you know she asked um sean and sean told her that he's as and i was like really you're as i'm as too so she was very disappointed on hearing that the both of them were as okay i actually sensed that she the guy was getting into her head so much okay she literally liked the guy and you know the expression on her face when she heard it was as was quite disappointing one has also had the conversation of her looking forward to her first kiss with sean okay and it could be at the pool party or probably the saturday night party okay so we do not know when her first kiss will come but we are here to know when the first kiss will come I, I want to know how it will play out okay so guys we also have onyeka <laughs> onyeka the checkers okay one of the pairs of the checkers all right onyeka has been very out there like 
she has been everywhere you see oyeka everywhere snooping around looking for g's to carry looking for who and who that she wants to ship together like that has been her major work in the house it's quite interesting okay i feel like that's the strategy she came with to the house okay trying to um pair people together um as ships okay and we want to see where that will lead her to so guys we're also going to talk about this people the um double k yes the married couple in the house the couple that said that they are not going to allow any of the housemates to know about their marriage status okay they would come into the house and pose her as besties that was what they said at the lunch show okay that nobody in the house would know that they are married so guys so far so good these people have been trying to put up with the act but it seems that they have not tried enough okay their trying is not strong or good enough because most of the housemates have figured out that people are they are beyond best okay chiwe has said it onyeka major kelly these people are literally suspecting that these people are actually in a relationship or married all right so chiwe one of the pair of the zinwe okay told her boyfriend that that he should study this um people well she studied the double k well that these people do not act as besties at all they act like married people guys like she said married people and i'm like how can this girl be so observant like she will literally pays attention to details all right for her to figure out that these people are even married hey i was surprised okay because she told her boyfriend that and her boyfriend was like i beg you safe do you understand so guys the thing is that these people are sometimes i feel like they forget themselves okay i feel like they forget themselves because early today um her husband reminded her that ah, they did not pray today let's pray to god okay so they knelt down in their room and started praying <laughs> and i'm like these people are bringing in married energy to the house okay me myself i've been looking at these people and i've been like these people are not acting like besties i feel like this their plan or their game will not work for them in the house these married people posing as besties cannot work, okay? At the point, they will just lose guard. They will forget that they're actually acting, okay? These people would have just come in with the idea of being in a relationship, okay? Like being like girlfriend and boyfriend. So that we'll know that, all right, at the point, they are safe. Nobody will even know that these people are married. But for them to come up with the idea of besties, uh, it's going to be very easy for the housemates to suspect. What if now other housemates decide to throw themselves at them, okay? Being that, okay, this particular guy likes this one, you know, they start throwing themselves at them. What will be their reaction? Like, how will they able? <laughs> hey, guys, it's going to be a lot, okay? I want to see how this, their plan will play out in the house if at a point they will lose guard and forget themselves, all right? And just fold their hands. So, guys, that being said, the Indian ma. India Ma have been complaining a lot, okay? Especially Chine, all right? The aunt. Chine has been complaining about the cold. Big brother called this too much. I am feeling cold. And the point she was even crying, say. <laughs> and I'm like, ha, hey, yeah, sorry, your auntie. This big brother's house, eh? See, a lot of people have been complaining. Even the past housemates have been complaining how the cold is so much in Big Brother's house, okay? So I feel like when you're coming into a show like this, when you know that it will be 247 AC and it's not something that you can just, you know, operate with your hand, you should be ready. Like, you should be over ready for it, okay? Pack things, pack jacket, pack sweater, <laughs> pack something that will cover you up very well, all right? Probably China was not informed about how Big Brother's house is always cold, okay? She might not have heard from past housemates complaining about the cold in the house because of the way they almost naked themselves in the house, okay? Wearing revealing clothes, showing flair, showing body. So she might not know that ah, this is how the house is uh, until she enters. She now knew that, eh? <laughs> I bet bro, the cold is cold in. Okay, so guys, that is basically what have been going on in the house. I'm literally enjoying the house. Okay, I'm enjoying the house, babe. But this shipping thing strategy, okay? So I'm basically thinking that if you shift with a guy in the house, is to gain her more camera time, more attention, more this, more that. And you know, probably they think, okay, when I ship with this guy, probably when I'm in a relationship with this guy, you know, I would get the fan, I would get the this. No. All right, that's literally a very, I feel like that's a very shallow way of, you know, getting the love of the viewers. You don't need to be in a relationship before you give us content okay you don't need to at all and it's just so early to start even thinking about relationship it's not even it's it's barely 24 hours in the house and you're already 
thinking of being in a relationship. Haba. <laughs> Haba. Okay, well, let's just see how it goes in the house. So guys, that is basically all for today's video. Thank you so very much for watching. This is Substance TV. Please do also subscribe to this channel, like, and also put your comment below on the comment section. Let me know what you think about the housemates. And do not forget to turn on your post notifications so when I post the video, you would be informed. See you guys in my next video. Until then, stay splendid.